Hey guys, welcome back to Smith Family Pastures. I just wanted to bring you along with me today as I show you a little bit of um, what we've been doing this winter here on the farm, rolling out our hay and where the cattle are right now. So stay tuned. So here we are up in the clear cut. And as you can see, as I scroll by, there's all kinds of hay and manure distribution. And then there's a lot of urine distribution also. And as we walk over here, you'll see our cattle. They rolled out some hay for them this morning. And they're content as can be just eating their hay. We'll go a little bit closer and watch them here. But this is our clear cut. As you can see, all kinds of stumps everywhere and you'll see where they've been rolling out the hay. I'll have to show you guys this again in the spring and in the summer with how much grass and clover and all kinds of stuff that comes up it's amazing this used to be woods and now we've got all kinds of grasses growing it's just amazing to watch the soil being built and it's just so much healthier now just eating away and see how they're all lined up they're spreading out that manure so we don't have to hi I'm Emily with Smith Family Pasture we were walking around in our clear cut today it is currently spring and it's May 23rd and in here is where we have rolled out a lot of hay this winter. This used to be covered in wood, and then we got it clear cut, and then for the past couple years, we've been rolling out hay and moving the cattle through and building the soil and the grasses. And we just wanted to bring you along and show you the different grasses and forage that the clear cut now has after rolling out hay. So there's a lot of orchard grass. As you can see, all the orchard grass seed heads here. We've got a good patch of red clover here. You can see the red clover seed heads. And then if you dig way down in here, you can see the litter from rolling out the hay and moving the cattle through. Oh, that's earthworm poop. Yeah, all of that. See all that earthworm poop? That is amazing. They're doing their job, helping build the soil too. Dig around over in here. Let's see what we got down in here. Oh wow. There's all kinds of earthworm poop in there. It's like nothing but it. Yeah nothing but earthworm poop and litter and they're eating this litter and turning it back into earthworm poop which builds the soil so much that's amazing and this used to be covered in poop from the cattle and so basically the earthworms have helped break that down and build the soil and then this is what it grows and we've also got some different grasses, some fescue in here. Here's some fescue. You wanna show them some fescue here? This is fescue seed head. And then there's also some blue grass that we saw. There's some back there. There's some blue grass. And here's some white clover. More earthworm poop. That is awesome. It's so exciting to see the different results from all the hard work of rolling out the hay and moving your cattle around and 
pretty rewarding. I'm gonna walk this way and we'll talk a little bit more. So in the clear cut, um, we have not fertilized, put any artificial fertilizer on the clear cut here. Um, we basically just ran the cattle through here and they've spread their manure and urine and then we've rolled out hay for several winters now. And, you know, if you go in the woods and look on the ground, you're not going to see this. But it's pretty cool to take that and turn it into this. And um, I want to find the stump in here. I'm not sure where they are now. There's so much grass I can't see. Oh, here's just the stump. So, once we had this clear cut, um, Daniel was cleaning up the ground and getting all of the stuff that the guys left behind when they cut the trees down. And there's all these stumps. And he was like, what do I do with all these stumps? I got to take care of this land and I want to turn it back into grass for my cattle. And what am I going to do with all these stumps? So, in the end... He decided to leave all of the stumps. He did at first start taking some stumps away, which is up there. He was digging them up. And um, he just realized he was taking so much topsoil. So he only did just a little area like that. And he decided that that was not the way to go. He wanted to leave his topsoil here. And um, so anyways, he decided to leave the stumps. Um, they are rotting now. So... Um, all the different bugs and everything are consuming the uh, the stumps here, and we've got some fungus eating away at them. So, you know, we're leaving the stumps, but by doing that, it's built the soil so much because we haven't taken the topsoil away. So, we did that, and then rolling out hay and um, spreading the manure and urine, and it's pretty cool to see these results only thing about stumps is if you're driving through right now it's really hard to see um because i'm walking along here and it's hard to see through here it is so tall i mean it's about as tall as me i want to show you all the litter that's on top of the soil here. And there is all kinds of earthworm poop. That's basically all I'm digging in once I get down here. There's a lot of earthworm poop down in here. There's a lot right there. We were walking around the clear cut and we also found this huge patch of hairy vetch. It's so tall, and we're excited to move our cattle through here and let them graze on this. It's probably like over four feet tall. That's awesome. So we just wanted to bring you guys along and show you what it's looking like right now. And we hope you guys have a good day. Bye. Someone decided to throw their water bottle on the ground to make a YouTube video. Now they can't find it. Good luck with that. <laughs> she found it. <laughs> Oh, Laura Ingalls running through the field here.
water. <laughs>